Welcome again. And... Is it safe to say in last part of Barbarossa? Or not? That all depends on... One thing, if I manage to... Kill Beria or not. I'm still waiting for... Uh, fall events for Moscow and uh, Leningrad. Yeah, Saratov is mine, so let's move past Volga. And yeah, Beria is retreating, so probably I will overrun him now. This battle will progress. And whoops, I have some divisions here. Okay. Uh, well, let's deal with them in a minute. First, let's destroy those guys. And later, I will. Chase them. Okay, let's move those divisions here and here. Yeah, looking promising, and let's cross the river here. Yeah, I don't think uh, my fourth pastors will get to Stalingrad in time. Uh, they are trying to leave it. I mean the Soviets. Okay, maybe it feels a little gamey, but let's allow them to do that. Food rationing, no need. Come on, die already. And yeah, go back and deal with those divisions. And um, overrun here. Yeah, this is chasing those divisions is becoming a little annoying. Okay, so yeah, uh, winning is just a matter of a few days. Quite nice, to be honest. Uh, wasn't so hard. Sorry about that. But yeah, uh, in new version, Barbarossa is, in my opinion, still uh, harder than uh, in version 7 at least uh, that's my opinion but uh, it, it's still manageable with uh, certain amount of micromanagement and uh, keeping track of everything Yeah, I lost one province here. Let's attack those guys and wait for them to leave. Okay, basically, even if I wouldn't kill Stalin, uh, which would give, uh, which 
gave me 30% national uh, penalty, a national unity penalty for the Soviets, uh, I would still win. Yeah, Kuybyshev will be captured, uh, Kazan, uh, basically it's a matter of week, maybe two, maximum three. Uh, Stalingrad, same thing. So it's not like like that. Uh, mm -hmm. Stalin killing made the whole campaign. Plus, uh, I still have uh, victory points to take uh, in Caucasus. So yeah, uh, this would be definite victory. Definitely victory. Uh, before December, even without that little bit of luck with Stalin. Even those conscripts now doesn't don't don't look so scary. Now what we have here? Another bunch of conscripts. Let's also push here. And yeah, those guys are still sitting there. Chase that division. Yeah, Peria is dead. Oh, I lost another province. Oops. Oh yeah, it's already being attacked. And battle commander appeared here. Okay. Uh, what's going on? Oh yeah, I captured Kui Bishop. Uh, so yeah, game over. That was fast. Pretty nice and big Germany with small buffer between me and UK. Yeah, that was actually faster than I expected. Let's reward minor axis. Finland gets almost nothing. Okay, let's see what they have. Yeah, almost nothing. Some single random divisions and some conscripts in Caucasus. So, nothing that can be any threat for me. A lot of Soviets are still sitting in Finland, so... And yeah, what now? Let's... Let's wait for all strategic effects to kick in. 30 September, one of my fastest uh, Barbarossas, actually. Only two weeks slower than my personal record. Mm, those guys managed to survive. Good for them. Now, Heres Group Romania, or whatever it is called. Touch those guys to to it. Where is it? North. Nope. Nope. Well, wait, maybe it's already full. If 
five units, no only four. Okay, let's let's do it slowly. Let's redeploy them here. Move here all units that will be used for suppressing all that uh, area I should also have some Soviet equipment in some places or maybe not ok, anyway yeah. Wait, where are Ford Busters? Here. Let's stop them, rearrange them, and let's actually start. Time to start upgrading uh, my land units and focusing more on building navy. Let's check, check tech levels first. Yeah, nice. Uh, but I can also use more leadership now. I basically don't need to worry about officers anymore. So let's focus on all those techs that were neglected uh, up until now. Armor tech, yeah, assault guns will be useful. Paratroopers, not so much. Here everything is up to date. Maybe research also those ones, just in case I will decide to build something fancy like, like I don't know. SS Mechanized Infantry or something like that. Battleships. Let's let's build bat battleships. They are not great, but I love battleships. 74. Oops. Oh yeah, I have minus 50% penalty. I think maybe I can switch. Ah, no. How many? I see I'm get uh, manpower, 120 manpower. Yes, I basically have similar number of manpower uh, after Barbarossa, uh, like uh, before. And those few provinces are still bugged. Uh, still not added to any uh, area. Not a problem, I will simply edit them out later. Uh, oh, yeah, no crash, Gulf of Finland, control, yeah, and already some revolts. Oh, sorry guys, unfortunately I am the hiking of Skyrim now. And yeah, let's trade a bit, some more. I see to use. Okay, and what to add to the queue? Let's build. Holy crap! One thousand two hundred fifty-six days. This will take a lot of time. So maybe don't build battleships. Let's let's ignore battleships. Uh, so I have lots. Well, let some less per ice leadership. Never mind. Let's wait. <laughs> yeah, uh, deep mud. <laughs> okay. Uh, Light 
cruisers. Okay, let's add only 10 to the queue. Oh wait, I can switch back to uh, total economic mobilization. And here, Yodl. Where is Yodl? Yodl is here. This guy can be again replaced by Schacht, and I think that's all. Yeah. Oh, maybe France with. Oh, let's enjoy that extra leadership. I see won't be a problem anymore. Let's now think about uh, what will be attacked next. And I think I know. Like... Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Very added. Really? Uh, Leningrad factor is destroyed. Oh, yeah. Uh, military heroes from... Uh, War, so I actually have uh, more manpower than before the war. Uh, Stalingrad factory is destroyed. No, I don't need synthetic industry and fall of Leningrad. Yes, this will be very helpful even now. What do we have now? Some cavalry. Okay, let's take it. North division. Good. This one I won't touch. Some more U-boats, always welcome. And no need for more uh, HQs. Okay, what we have now? 614 IC. <laughs> Maybe built like, I don't know, 4 SS. Divisions. Yeah, I have service by recruitment and by uh, requirement. Let's switch to one year draft, maybe. Uh, it, oh, wait, it gives plus 10% leadership, so let's, let's leave that like this. No, I can't uh, because uh, I will be upgrading lots of units now. All uh, engineers in Panzer divisions would be upgraded to uh, um, armored engineers. So yeah, let's do that already. Oh yeah, I, I just changed the laws so to recalculate all the costs uh, on the next day. Armored engineer and wait, that's not all. Maybe it is. Harris Gruppe Sud, Harris Gruppe Mitte, Harris Gruppe North. Okay, now it will be everything. And Armored and Trainer. Okay, this will be ready before the end of the year. So, only thing that is left is waiting. Finland is mobilizing, god knows what for. Actually, I could send my boys to homes for Christmas. Let's check how is Italy doing in, uh, here. Uh, not so bad. Busters, yeah, almost here. Construct is on the fall of Moscow. Okay. Let's see. Yeah. The orange I see a bit. Okay. I'm being 
bombed somewhere all the time. And... Where exactly? This is... Eight. Uh, those are... Uh, eight port... Uh, eight port... Uh, no, uh, port bombings. So... This doesn't count. Here, yeah, here. But I have, some, yeah, I have some interceptors here. So let's keep them on mid superiority mission over here. Okay, Turkey will be my next victim. Maybe I should send some. Mobile divisions there. I like those those ones. Let's do that already. Oh, and I think I can for now switch to automatic convoys. <laughs> At least for some time. New battle commander, let's hope that uh, I can build one more. Okay, now I need to find some job for my fort pastors so they won't be bored. There is no, though. So let's let's just re rearrange them back into proper divisions. And start upgrading them. And I think half trucks will be a great addition to those divisions. And of course, armored engineers. Let's rebase them to Berlin. Oh, Nelon, nice. Let's take it. Some trades, yeah. Accept, accept, accept. Now, uh, Perm, where is Perm? Perm was uh, had much rare materials, yeah. So let's build some. Oh, uh, by the way, uh, this is something that can't be suppressed. Default revolt risk after annexing a country. So putting any uh, mi uh, military police or uh, any other unit like that here is pointless. Good. Uh, good thing is, uh, on the other hand. some units on those uh, resource-rich uh, provinces in which we are building uh, resource buildings uh, because once they get captured by partisans uh, it will simply stop so Avoid that, just uh, always keep some units over such province. And for 
that all those HQs are great. Let's push that, that uh, building to the top. Okay, yeah, I have a huge surplus of officers. Okay, Moscow was basically level at. Not much in Leningrad except two training bases and urban expansion. And Stalingrad, maybe something interesting. And what? Saratov. Actually, heavy IC survived and one tank factory. Nice. Mountain unit training. Okay. But fighting somewhere. Oh, here. Okay. Let's support this attack. Okay, I will. Give my troops time to rest to, till the end of the year, and from next year I will start uh, attacking Middle East. And pushing towards India. Actually, Italians are doing a great job in Africa right now. I will also attack from here. I have army big enough to do all that. Or maybe I will wait so the British will, uh, Americans actually will do uh, Operation Torch. Japan is slowly progressing in Pacific. Yeah, I wonder when it will declare war on the United States if it uh, will be in November or historically in December. More and more spare I see. I still have all those penalties from building a yeah, rail re rebuild. Total of 37%. Quite a lot. So I will have more than 800 I see. Portugal. Yeah, also from New Year I will start uh, Battle of Britain. And for that actually I could start building more interceptors. Actually, how many I have now? Air units 131. A total of 319. Veteran Air Force only 51. Air battles, okay. Looking at this one, 
yeah, I need more planes, ships, and more tax researched. guys are on the move. I think I should redeploy some air units. Cl little closer to the uh, Turkey. But mostly light bombers. Uh, It's kinda far away from any uh, from any of my air bases. It's level four airfield, level one, level five, level three, level ten. So I can put them in Odessa, which is now part of Romania. I think they made a pretty good deal. Let's replace them here. Level 6, so I can move one more interceptor wing here. Okay, so more imagine bombers. Imagine uh, light bombers. Yeah, level 10. Okay, I think this will be enough to take Turkey. And just wait. Okay, all those units are almost here. And one more. And those guys, let's move them here. And maybe I will use them somewhere around the world at some point. Okay, it's time to finish this part. Oh, yeah. Conscripts were disbanded, and basically. Soviet Union was left without army completely. Only few units. Okay. Ah. Okay, it's level 40, so keep researching. Let's make some. Yeah, okay. And see you in the next part.